Ever since Roblox launched the Bifron anti-cheat thing, we were unable to run Roblox on Linux. And while they did decide to allow Bifron to run on Linux for a while, they decided to retract on that and then disallow us. So it's impossible again. However, if you take a look at this site right now, soberfinegarhq.org, you can see it says Roblox on your Linux desktop and it's updated at August 1st, 2024. So how is this even possible? Well, we're using the Roblox Android version. So let me guide you through this real quick. Let me click on learn more and it shows everything here. Make sure a flat pack installed, which I'm using Fedora. This is a, a fresh install of Fedora 40. Anyway, you want to click on download flat pack. It'll download this thing. I already downloaded. So if I open this, it'll open up the GNOME software center and it'll let you install it. I already installed it. So I'm going to hit open. All right. Now, as you can see here, if you click on continue, it'll ask you to get a Roblox app ABK bundle. So you want to go to ABK mirror. Oh, there's an ad. <laughs> And uh, oh, come on, stop auto focus. You want to scroll down, and you can see the universal APK. You want to make sure you pick universal because if you pick any of these here, it'll run through an emulation layer, which will drop your FPS or your overall performance by like 30%. If you use universal, it'll actually use whatever that's compatible, like x86. So click on this. And download the latest version of the bundle. We'll let this finish. All right, now that we got the APK downloaded, let's go ahead and open up Sober again, select application bundle and select the newly downloaded bundle and it should do something about it. And let's open up Sober. And there we go. We're in Roblox, it's crazy. Let me just log in with another device. I'm gonna use my laptop that in my other side, I'm using it for recording the audio. To log in real quick. And we're in. This is crazy. Holy crap. Let me try. What should I play? You know what? Let's go hard. Let's play Arsenal. On Linux. Oh god, this is crazy. Okay. Oh. Oh, it did. It does not detect any like mobile stuff, so it's actually playing properly. All right, let's check our F FPS. Okay, not bad. We're at 60 FPS, holy crap. And mouse actually works, yo. Oh, and I'm dead. <laughs> This is insane. Hold on. I need to get my camera sensitivity to us uh, somewhere usable. Oh, we're dropping to 40. That's fine. I couldn't find anyone or, oh, I can't hear a thing. Hold on. Wow, I'm so bad at this game. But yeah, it works. Okay, you know what? Before I start embarrassing myself, yeah, Roblox on Linux works again, and it works really well. I am very amazed by this. Like, we're getting 40 FPS, but yeah. Alright, I'm gonna close this now. 
All right, before we end this, I'm going to, uh, I have a Windows install in this SSD right here that I'm used to booting right now because this laptop's SSD is broken and I don't have small screwdrivers. So we're booting off USB, but I have a Windows install. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try run Arsenal, but in Windows and see like, like compare the performance. See if we're also getting about 40 FPS there. Although I wouldn't be able to make it exact because we'll not play at the same map. By the way, this is a fresh install of Windows 10 IoT Enterprise. Like I did not touch it or anything. All right. All right, we're getting about 37 FPS, which is worst. Oh, yeah, it it runs exact at like the same performance as running it on Linux. Holy crap, this is crazy. I'm so bad at this. I should just stop trying. All right, you know what? Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. So yeah, that's Roblox on Linux. It runs just as well as playing it on Windows and uh, it works pretty well, surprisingly. I would say, I want to say thank you for the devs who's working at Sober because that's a huge accomplishment. I might consider switching back to Linux now. Although I have like other games that I play now, but you know. But the fact that Roblox works on Linux again is just wonderful. So yeah, if you find this video helpful, uh, hit the like button. And also if you find it interesting. If you want to see more from me, hit the subscribe button. I mostly do Flood Escape 2 videos. And don't if you're sub subscribed, don't forget to hit the bell. It'll let you know if I upload a new video. And yeah, comment what you think about the video and I'll see you next time. Bye.